hello hello welcome once again to my channel and if you're new extra welcome of course um yeah so today it's time for my art stacks project again i do it once a month uh, officially anyway and uh, i often use art stack stuff more times than that but uh, more like for myself <laughs> in those cases so today i'm using my um i was thinking of what stack i should use but i decided for the um, enemies enemies and i hardly can pronounce it enemies and friends kit um it's the card stack actually and uh, i don't make many cards as i've said before but you can easily use those in your art journaling also of course so i'm starting my spread with my homemade transparent gesso as a base and you can also use it for gluing your um, elements on of course so i'm just ripping out a few of the beautiful flowers i'm not really sure what they are called these flowers so i guess it doesn't really matter they're really beautiful anyway and uh, yeah so i'm gonna go simple today but i'm also gonna use coffee that's a bit unusual for me but i think it's fun um, but first I'm going to use modeling paste with a stencil, it's kind of like a mandala stencil and this one is from Panduro, my workplace, so I don't think you can get it anymore anyway, So, but I guess you can use any stencil you have of course, uh, just for some texture on the spread. And now I'm wetting it again and I'm spraying on the coffee. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I think it's nice to use coffee and you get a nice smelling, uh, smelling spread also. And fun fact, I don't really drink coffee. I don't like it at all. I've never learned to, to appreciate coffee. I drink a lot of tea instead. But uh, of course <laughs> you can also use it for your journaling. And I'm also adding a bit of white gesso with my fingers, like you saw here, just for some smoothening up of the spread. And now some vintage sepia ink stamping with a, it's a wooden stamp that I have um, from before. It doesn't really matter, ma matter either. Um, so these are my favorite quotes or wordings. These are from the inspirational kit, inspirational words stacks. And uh, as you see, they are like um, tissue papers. And I love using them in all my work actually, almost. And I'm just deciding here where to put them, of course. Placement is yeah important kind of it is important but I don't really think about it too much because I want to be spontaneous when I work and I really am um, I'm just not really happy because it should be quite straight anyway and I'm using my transparent gesso again for adding those words and I'm adding gesso on top of everything, just in case, just to preserve it more, the paint or the coffee actually. Um, I have used no paint here. And uh, yeah. So this is actually nearly done because I want to keep it simple today. I'm just adding some distress ink on the edges of the spread. But I was thinking you could use coffee for that also, of course just a sponge and some coffee and then it's done and I really like this one it's simple and a bit vintagey maybe um, but I like the soft colors contrasting with the red flowers and as I said I love the words here laughter is the sound of the soul dancing and happiness is an inside job and I've used them before of course but I think they deserve to be used more than once and to be heard or read more than once of 
course. So this is it. And it's funny, uh, but now I'm smelling like coffee. Uh, but even though I don't drink coffee, I really love the smell of it. So <laughs> that's a bonus. And visit Art Stacks to purchase some of these papers if you like them. So I'm going to leave you a link in the description also. Thank you and stay safe. Bye.